Me, and the question is, how can I hit the ball farther? Okay, and this is a question that a lot of women ask because they do struggle with club head speed. Uh, so let's hit on a couple things, uh, equipment-wise and also swing-wise, that can help you hit the ball farther. Uh, the first thing is, is the ball. The ball has a huge impact on whether you uh, can carry it farther or not. So what I would suggest is most women hit a ladies' ball. That's usually going to be an 80 compression ball or lower. Uh, Bridgestone actually does a ball fitting and hopefully we get them on the show to demonstrate what their ball fitting does with the challenge that they do but they have every type of ball for every type of player so a ball fitting is actually really relevant uh, to women so then we can find out what your club head speed is uh, what your ball speed is and how you can maximize that distance so we want to make sure most women need to be probably at a 60 compression ball or 70 compression ball and if you go precept or any of those balls at Bridgestone uh, you're gonna probably find the right ball for you okay so that's a that's a part of the equipment issue the other part is the shaft that you use for your, your club uh, make sure that you have the right shaft that's another uh, part of the club fitting process uh, with the flex and having the right flex in the in the shaft of the club really helps you get a little more distance uh, because you're not gonna have to swing as hard uh, if you have the correct uh, flex and your balance has everything to do with that so if you're swinging too hard you're gonna be out of balance you probably have too stiff of a club shaft so we want to make sure that's a, a good fit for you. So come see your PGR professional and uh, he'll make sure that you have the right ball and the right club uh, for, for you to maximize your distance. Now, when it comes to the swing for maximizing your distance, uh, Jim McLean talks about the X factor. I like to, I'm a big fan and proponent of Jim McLean and how he teaches. We do that at SWS Golf in our programs. And so what we do is we talk about the X factor. The X factor is the um, angle that you create between your shoulders and your hips. And so I'll just demonstrate here quick for you. Um, so I'll put one, one of these uh, teaching aid tools on my shoulders and then one on my hip. So when I swing, if I create a bigger angle between this stick and the one below, I'm creating more torque and more power. So what, that, what helps with having a better turn is a good posture and setup. So if we have a poor posture in our back, is hunched you're not going to be able to turn as much but if you have good posture and you're in a good setup you're going to be able to rotate more with your shoulders your hips need to stay somewhat uh, in the same position they're going to move a little bit with your upper body but we want to try to keep that lower body solid and cre create a nice separation between your lower body and your upper body and this will really help you maximize that distance and, uh, and create more club head speed so uh, again send in your questions to us go to Ozarks 19th hole uh, on our website just click on that logo you can click on uh, got questions and then that send your question uh, to us and we'll we'll answer that on at the beginning of the show just like we did